is Jill Sargent from Wildlife Fitness and I'm doing my first video for our adventure race training of the season and you might think it's winter because it's snowing but it is April the 10th uh, and we are literally one month away from Tough Mudder. If you've been or if you're close to Mount St. Louis you will notice that it's completely covered in snow. So if you haven't started training outside get your butt outside find some mud find some water and start training in the elements because if you've spent all winter in the gym it's time to get your butt outside and start training in the snow. As you can see, we are still piled and covered in snow. My group just finished an amazing training in this lovely frosty snow in April and I'm going to give you a little sample of what we did and then I'll give you a workout that you can do for the next month. But my advice to you today is get your butt outside because it could be snowing, it could be hailing, it could be thunder, lightning, anything. It's Canada, it'll be May, and the hills are still covered in snow. Good luck! Here's a little sample of what we were doing today. Some pull-ups. There's Jeff. And if you note, he's in a puddle of mud. Yeah, we don't do things in nice weather. And there we go. We're also doing some deadlifts today. Darcy's doing some deadlifts. And last week we were doing this. We were probably on ice. No, just kidding. Don't do it on ice. That's dangerous. We're getting ready for our adventure racing series. Here's Mel battling out the ropes. She's rocking it out in the snow. That's right, we don't mess around. We've been training outside in the winter, all winter, and it's time to get outside. As promised, I said that I would give you a quick workout that you can do at home. Um, outside, of course, that is your key for this week, is to work out outside, get your stuff done outside in the elements. It, if it is snowing, that is part of your training. So here is your workout now. Good job, guys! 